When you run the software installation, the system will install the database server, the Microsoft SQL server, into your system. And then the system will install the auto count accounting program. After that, the system will install the first database file, that is your first time start, in your C drive auto count data, followed by the name of the database that you key in. After the system created an account book, this is the database and the account book, the system will do the attached database file from your physical location to database server. And then the system will attach the account book from database server to the auto account accounting system. Now, all these are done at the same time. You may not be aware of it. After that, if you create a new account book, the system will repeat the step 3A, 3B, and 3C. To create a database is to create a physical database. To attach the database file is to attach the database to your database server. AutoCAD Accounting will attach the account book from the database server. That means AutoCAD Accounting is retrieving database from the database server. If you break the link between database server and AutoCAD Accounting, that is to detach account book. If you break the link between database and the physical file, that is to detach account book from the database server. To remove account book, is to actually remove the database physical file totally from physical file drive. This is a networking environment. PC1 is the server and is installed with database server. The server may or may not install the accounting software. Let's say this server has created an account book and account book is attached to the database server. Workstation 1 will install accounting and will attach the account book from the database server. Similarly to Workstation 2, install auto account accounting and then attach the account book from the database server. This workstation can start working with accounting software. Whatever they have done, they will save to the account book in database server. Workstation may also attach a couple from another database server if they have more than one database server. To break the link, Workstation can always detach the account book from database server. After the first time start, you have created an account book, AAA, and now let's log into this account book. Let's go to File, Manage Account Book. As you can see, there's only one account book being displayed. To create a new account book, click on Create Account Book and put in a company name, let's say BBB, Sundriyan Berhad, and click on Next, Next again, Next again, and Finish. Then you can see there is a BBB, a new account book being displayed. To attach an account book, click on Attach Account Book. To attach account book means to create a link to database server. If you know the server name, you can key in the server name, which is computer name, followed by the instant name. Or you can just click on get available servers, and the available servers in the uh, networking will be displayed. In my case, I will select this server, and I can click on get available databases to list the database available on this server. Let's say happy and OK. So there is a account book being attached. Remark is to differentiate one account book from another. Version refer to the database version. Different uh, version of the program will need different databases. Obviously, this is the older version of the database. Server is the computer name backslash the instant name. And this is the database name. Having created this one, let's take a look at the Windows Explorer. Look at C drive, uh, that is a folder, auto count data, and database file. In my case, I have created two databases in my PC. So there are two databases here, AAA and BBB. The happy database is not created in this PC. It was attached from another server, so you cannot see here. You may detach an account book which means to stop the link of the account book with database server. Highlight the account book that you want to detach and click on detach account book. Yes, it needs the admin password to proceed. Okay, detach successfully. Now be aware that to detach the account book is not to remove it, it's not to delete the account book. To delete the account book, you highlight the account book and then you click on delete account book. Click on yes and yes. 
put in the admin password so it was successfully deleted to edit the account book is to change the server name or the database name of an existing account book you can also install sample account book here to install a sample account book is to create an account book and to copy the data from the sample account book there are three ways to install a sample account book you can download and install from AutoCAD website, from AutoCAD Accounting CD room, from a specified folder if you have copied the installer into your hard drive. No matter which method you use, you can choose from these two account books. I would advise you to take mobile phone trading Cinderella as a sample account book because this one contains more transactions. To know the details on how to run this installation of a sample account books, you can refer to AutoCAD Accounting Help File 2009. That's all for Managed Account Book. Thank you.